Groups love to rank cities and states for all kinds of reasons. If you drive just about anywhere, this one should come as no surprise to you. Minnesota is the worst state for potholes, according to a study by Quote Wizard, which is a part of Lending Tree. The researchers analyzed online searches for pothole complaints and repairs. Minnesota ranks first, followed by California and Washington. Wisconsin's all the way down at number 38. The group also broke down pothole problems by city. Minneapolis second only to Los Angeles. Duluth ranks seventh. The highest ranked Wisconsin city is La Crosse coming in at number 48. A pothole plan for, a Minnesota, for Minnesota's capital city just got its first green light. But as WCCO's David Schumann explains, it comes at a cost. This is the worst year for potholes probably in th more than 30 years. Preaching to the choir in St. Paul, where drivers have worked to avoid the nasty craters for months. Everywhere you go, there's a pothole. I don't know, you know, it's, it's just too much. There are a couple hubcaps that people lost. They were over on the boulevard. But credit where credit's due. Neighbors are taking notice of improvements on their blocks. They've been getting better, though. Um, they're not as everywhere as they were a month or two ago. Well, they filled them all. I mean, we did. St. Paul has the chance for a longer term change later this year. The legislature will allow the city to put a 1% sales tax on the ballot in November, letting voters decide. The city says this money would be used to remake the streets. It'd be a, an increase of a penny on every dollar that they spend on sales tax eligible items in St. Paul. The streets that people have been most frustrated this winter, I can see your car shaking right now, are streets that we would work on and um, completely rebuild with the sales tax funds. Fixes everyone surely wants, but will people be willing to pay up for it? It is a tough question. Uh, I don't know. I think I'd really have a hard time voting for a 1% sales tax, to tell you the truth. Always, I, I don't hesitate to pay taxes as long as I could see it right there in front of me when I get out of my house. In St. Paul, David Schum, WCCO News. The mayor and the city council will have the final say about whether to put the proposal on the ballot this year.